This is where it's gonna get real interesting. Are you ready, class? Hello, and welcome to Kendall's Kitchen. I'm your host, Professor Flores. You'll be learning how to make cardamom ice cream. We have three fourths cup of sugar, eight green cardamom pods, a vanilla bean, cardamom powder, four egg yolks, three fourths cup heavy cream, and two cups of, I wanna whip up your whipping cream using an electric mixer with my hand. It's never gonna happen. You're gonna whisk it until it becomes whipped cream. Now you're gonna heat your milk with your cardamom pods and vanilla bean. In the meantime, you're gonna mix your egg yolks with your sugar until you get a thick, ribbony consistency. Once your milk has come up to a simmer, you can remove the cardamom pods and discard them and scrape your vanilla bean and return it to the milk. At this time, you want to bring your mixture to a room temperature to infuse the flavors. We're going to bring this back up to temperature um, and then we're going to temper it with the eggs that we mixed up with sugar before. We're going to add this back to our saucepan here. Whisk it pretty fast. Now you're gonna heat it up until it thickens. Here you can tell it's thick enough and uh, it's not running when you put your finger across like that. All right, so after this is done cooking, you're gonna let it come up to room temperature and stir it every five minutes. Then we're gonna strain out any leftover cardamom that's still in there. After you strain that out, we're gonna add our uh, cream that we whipped up before and just gonna fold that in. Just gonna pour our mixture into a uh, stand-up mixing bowl. We're gonna be using liquid nitrogen to make the ice cream come together. We have our cream base and now we have to cool it down somehow. Instead of using the traditional ice cream machine, this is what we'll be using. Safety's pretty important. You need uh, some glasses just to, in case any liquid nitrogen spurts up, you don't wanna get it in your eyes. Other than that, you don't really need too much because it will just beat off and roll right off of you. As long as you got glasses, you'll be good. But always be careful. Good idea to go around instead of staying in one place. The sides of the bowl are going to get really cold and you're going to get freezing uh, cream right on the sides. So the best thing to do is to have a blowtorch next to you. And there you have it. Your cardamom ice cream.